there from Bug Eye Guys. Today we have a 1960 Austin Healey 3000 Mark I for sale. Let me pause just to appreciate. This thing is the most sensual, gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I just never get tired of looking at these. It's really one of the more gorgeous sports cars in my humble opinion. And it's nice to have one that's this beautiful and what I feel is the right color. This would be what I'd call British Racing Green. And it's really quite striking. It's a very special car. It's been owned for the last 12 years by a fellow here in Connecticut who took really good care of it. Spent a lot of money on improvements. I think he probably put in those driving lights in the front. And he also just recently had the head off where he did a valve job and put in hardened seats. So the car was maintained so that he could use it as a driver and it's a great driver. I mean, it's a showable driver. Everything about this car is really excellent. It's such a straight car. The restoration underneath is really quite beautiful. Uh, it was done in California years ago, so the paint is older, but certainly excellent paint. A um, couple little flaws from use, like some touch-up spots here. A couple little places where the paint is just not perfect. There's a little bit of a flare running through here. I don't know if you can see that. It has to be in just the right light. But, you know, the paint's not perfect. It's older, but still excellent paint. It shines really nicely. And the chrome is beautiful. The grill is beautiful. I'm really in love with this car. Uh, the of side curtain cars, this Mark I is just a really cool deal. This is how you put the top up. This, this seat lifts out. And then the frame on this one, it actually has a little slide the whole frame assembly slides forward and then you can put it up to hold up the hood or the top. And everything over here is in pretty good shape. The, um, the heater switch is this blower, you pull it out for the fan, but it's a, uh, it works. You have to hold it up. So this switch probably needs to be replaced. If we could find an NOS switch, that would be great. These reproductions are probably not the greatest quality. Here are the driving light switch. That's the switch for those two lights in the bumper. The overdrive works as you'll see in the driving video. And these are the trafficators. If you're unfamiliar, that's right and left turn with the indicator on the dash. And this is just heat air and fresh air, the choke, the starters over on that side, the wipers over there and the side and headlights are here and all that stuff is working. The wipers are one speed and they do park. I mean, this is nice too. These were restored and so they look really good. And the dash top is really nice. There is a tonneau. The interior is in nice shape. The seat bases look new. And so do these rear seats. So, you know, all in all, this is a very, very strong car in really nice shape. The trunk is also very clean. The trunk lids in good, good order. There's the tonneau in that plastic bag. We'll put that out and take some pictures. And here's the Hardora covering in the trunk. The battery kill switch is right here by my toe. And that's a nice deck of battery that seems very strong. And a knockoff wheel hammer in there as well. So all in all, this is just one of those special cars. Little things like, I just think these are really cool. It's beautiful door latches and the door action is good, and the alignment here is quite good. So new 48 spoke chrome wheels. It's just a lot about this car I really enjoyed, and I'll show you in the driving video how nicely it drives. It sounds great, performs well, and a really good car.